Hey, yo, surf. Yo, 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 surf. Yo, 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 surf, surf, surf. Yo, surf, where you at? Let me holler at you for a second. Hey, yo, 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 yo. Let me, let, let, can I, can I, can I, let, let me talk to you, my G's. Have you seen Gilly the Kid online recently? Yo, he is frying you. Why is he cooking you like this? I, 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 don't, I, I don't even know what the backstory is, but yo, he is, he is cooking you. Like, I, he feel like you lost to read. Like he, and there's people out there who feel that way. And I told you, I said, sir, if you lose rounds or if you take rounds off versus read dollars, you gonna make this debatable, which some people have it. I still have him winning the first surf, winning the first and second round, but he made it debatable. The third round, clearly to me, I got Reed taking it. And in the second round, Reed had moments. So now you got people saying this is debatable, but Gilly the Kid was kind of like cooking you last night. Surf shit was short though. He, he jerseyed that shit, man. He did. I ain't like that. He jerseyed it. He cut his shit short in the third round. He went so, crazy. So Reed baked the shit out in the third round. Yeah, he got the third. I ain't gonna hold you. In the, the, second, legend, though. In the you know? second round, and the second round was debatable. You could argue that. Yeah, you could argue it, but I gave it to Surf. Cause you from Newark, nigga. You was supposed yeah. to give it to Surf. I, look, I said he lost before, so I ain't no bias, nigga. You feel me? Come on, dog. But I say, Let me say something. Let me just say something, dog. Sue Surf getting debatable wins, man. He will tell, tell you that though. None he don't be trying to kill niggas. The niggas can't beat him. None of my battles ever was debatable. I don't even know what debatable is. <laughs> I gotta see you battle, man. You talk a lot. Let me just tell you something. Just like when I played basketball. I never came off the bench in my life. Elementary yeah. school, high school, college. I never came. I never was a backup in my life. I don't even know what it feel like to back another nigga up. I never was a backup singer. <laughs> Fuck is wrong. I don't, hey, yo, I don't, I don't, I don't know what it is to be a backup singer. Now, it's niggas on here right now that's saying Sue Surf lost two rounds to one. Tell him, man. Tell him I said Jersey, man. Man, we need to get Sue Surf on here. It's everybody at Sue Surf. I'm get him back. Him. Matter of fact, add Reed Dollars for me. Everybody at my young boy Reed Dollars. I need, I need to get him the fuck. Adam. To find out who the fuck was. He can't he ain't beat Surf, man. He know he's there. Look at <laughs> It's niggas on hey, it's niggas on here that said it's niggas you can't on here that said he that that uh he beat two surf. Uh I ain't they tripping. say that he left Sue hurt. <laughs> they say he lifted up Sue skirt. They saying it was a body in that motherfucker. He damn near left Sue Merck. <laughs> Nah. I'm just telling you what they say. Man. I don't care what they say, man. Jersey, man. Wait, hold on. Nigga say Sue lost the verb, too. The verb? Nah. Yeah. I'm clear lost. I give surface. Uh, what's that? Uh, Charlie Clips. Oh, Go watch that. So, so let me just say this then. That's so when Clips was wild, though. She was the best at that time. Nobody could put that at that time. Well, let me just say something. So, so... So if Sue lost, then what you're saying is he's beatable. Yeah, I think anybody beatable. Oh, no, no, no. no. Okay. Floyd wasn't beatable. Rocky Masiali wasn't beatable. And I ain't beatable. You beatable. I ain't beatable. You beatable. You can't be. I don't even think you could be Arsenal. You probably can't even be sure. You can't even be shotgun sure, man. It was, I'm, I'm quite sure you know those all note niggas. I don't think you be neither one of them. Being honest, man. Don't get me wrong, your pen game crazy though. I ain't gonna hold you. You got a good pen game, but I don't think you're ready for them though. In this, like in today's era, type. You know what I'm saying. 
You got to see you on that stage, man. You see what happened to your boy Cassidy, man. You see what Arsenal did to him. You was there. You left the stage. Why you walked off the stage? Let me just tell you something, y'all. Why you walked off the stage, though? Let me just tell you something. No disrespect, but I'm not Cassidy. Oh, you right. But why you walked off the stage, though? We... <laughs> Why you walked up the stage? You ain't gonna answer that. I mean, I'm always trying to leave. I like to leave before everybody else is leaving. I don't like to be stuck in a lot of traffic. <laughs> hey, yo, you know it. I don't like to be stuck in a lot of traffic, dog. That nigga's. Yeah, that's why I got out of it. Nah. And nigga Arsenal was doing them dirty. By the way, I'm an Eagle fan too. You heard? You see the jersey? Oh, believe that. Well, I'm You're ready. With me. All right, bro, bro. Let me see if they got Reed Dollars or Sue Surf on it. For real, I need to talk to my fucking yellow boy. We'll read that, man. I said, why are you doing this? Hello? He was cooking. I don't know if he wants to battle you. I, I listen. Now Gilly does very well with what he does in his um, podcast career, uh, you know, and when he does the videos, talking, talking his talk and things like that. He do a very good job at that, you know what I'm saying? He hasn't really been um, on the rapping scene in a, in a couple years now, but I remember him from uh, Major Figures, and I remember him from when he was with the Cash Money and all of that. But it's um, been some time removed, but he has a huge following. He has over a million followers on Instagram. And Instagrams, uh, and I happened to be just scrolling my timeline, and I literally just tripped across this footage, and I, I'm gonna play, check it out, and I just saw him cooking you, and I'm like, whoa, he really, really is like, he feeling himself, and he said that he ain't never lost a battle, never, like, no, no, never. Now I don't know if I want to see Gilly the Kid in the ring, you know what I'm saying? He did talk about. Why he uh, left Cass, you know what I'm saying? Um, I, I don't blame him because Cass was getting cooked and he was just rhyming about nothing. But you know what? We're past the Cass stage. We, we, to me, I feel like we're past it. You know what I mean? He, he felt his way about how some of the people looked at his battle and evaluated the bars and all that. So we're not going to get into that right now. We're on Gilly. We're on Surf. Um, Cass was a way better battle rapper in his day. Not today. In his day, Cass is a very good battle rapper. You know what I'm saying? Um, rumor has it, urban legend, that he battled like everybody. He never lost from the freeway tapes. And he just like baked and cooked everything. So, you know, he has a history known in battling. Gilly doesn't have that much of a history known in battling. And his musical history, if, unless you like really from Philly and an enthusiast, his music history doesn't really resonate that well either. But he's a very respected individual and he does have quite a following. Um, if he was to battle, 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 like battle against Sue Surf, I would have Sue Surf winning strictly off the fact that Sue Surf does this style of battling. This style of battle rapping is different than just putting words together and rapping. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure Gilly, if he took his time and put some shit together, he could rap. I'm, I'm, I mean, it's like riding a bike. Of course, it's putting words together. But in this era, this stage and entertaining and doing what we do and then having, now their face off would probably be one of the best face offs ever. Like the Gilly just talking in his damn, in the videos, not the YouTube, in the videos that he puts out there, are funny as hell. I was laughing. That's why I had to capture the footage. I'm like, yo, this is hilarious. Why is he doing this right now? So, uh, that would be funny. Promotion would be phenomenal. But I just think it would be another situation where we have like cast where the promotion is phenomenal. But when you come down to the, when it comes down to the come down, it's like, can we just get promotion without no battle? Like just give me mad promotion and take away, can we substitute the battle? Like just give me all the promotion with extra fries, sweet potato fries, and just take away the battle. We don't we don't even want to see, we would rather see y'all talk trash to each other. I know that's for me, that's just me personal. I would just rather see y'all talk shit to each other and I'm sure that uh, Surf would not, I don't think he would take 
a battle with Rashid. He won't even take a battle with JC. The motherfucker said, he said, JC is lackluster. He won't, I, that bugged me out, you know? And I'll salute to JC for responding, but he won't even take a battle with JC. He wouldn't take a battle with I Solomon. So, Gilly, you definitely, if you want a battle with Sir, you gotta get all the way to the back of the line because I mean, like, all the way, 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 way to the back of the line because Surf ain't taking you. I, don't, I just can't see. Nope. Nope, nope. Can't see it happening. But, uh, what, yeah. <laughs> y'all tell me what y'all think of the footage. I thought the footage was hilarious. I'm not gonna lie. I thought Gilly definitely uh, found a way to get his words off. And he was talking about the battle. Like, that's the thing. Like, he was really legitimately talking about the battle. Talking about who he thought won, talking about Surf be having debatable wins, and I'm thinking from what I do as a you know blogging, this is prime footage to fall on. Like I, I tripped and stumbled across this. I'm like yo, and then it's good. And then somebody's asking him, uh, the homie in the video is asking him the legitimate questions that we really want the answers to. So uh, I thought it was it put it was put together well. But other than that, man, salute to the subscribers. That notification gang, get it, a kid talking his talk. To sue Surf. Surf! Don't act like you didn't hear this. Oh, you heard this. Oh, oh, you definitely heard this. Gilly was looking for you. He said, re baked you in the third round. He ain't say. He ain't say that it was like close round. He ain't say that, you know, he got a couple. He said he baked you. 350. Set the timer on, on 25 minutes. Went and took a shower and came back. Yo, he's like, yo. Turn the lights down low. I want to give you some good, good man. Bait you. You don't let that man go find that man. And don't come back until you find that man. Hello. Happy New Year. Don't get baked.